Hi folks, um, in this video I'm going to show you how to use a tool called Character Map. Um, this is it here, I'm just going to close it. If you go into the start menu and type in C-H-A-R, you should get an option. Um, so if you're using Windows or pretty much most operating systems, I believe you can type in that. Just click on Character Map and you get a number of options. Um, in this one, it's default into Calibri because that's what I used last. And if I scroll down to the bottom, I've got a number of options. So, for example, if I choose, let's say, I want this number here, um, so I can click select, I can click copy, and then I can go into a text object like this one here, and I can right click and say paste. So now I have the number 11. Sorry, if I go into font, font is not Calibri here, it's, now it is Calibri, it should change to number 11 and I can also change the color of the font because this is really handy um, if you go into general I can make it transparent so now we've got the number 11 we could also uh, go into properties to add an action maybe and the action to that could be um, layout activate she click OK and she could be SH01, so it should bring us to zero G1. So, and it has. So, there's actually, within the character map, there's lots of different, there's, uh, there's well over a hundred different uh, font types. And within each font type, there's different, uh, there's different kind of objects or let, what it could be letters or images that you can use. So, for example, I think there's one here called um, MS. It's one for MS Outlook. And if we scroll, we can choose this one here and click select, click copy. We can go into this text, text object here and um, get rid of the tree. Click. Oh. Try that again. You click copy, paste. Now it's saying E at the moment, but if I change the font to MS, as long as click view has it, MS Outlook, and click deploy, you should get that image of the, the two people together. So again, you could turn that into a button. I can change the color here. Let's say I want it to be red. and then change the background to transparent. You could then add a, a button to the text object and turn it into something like this that will switch to a, another sheet. So that's a click view using character map within Windows and um, just hundreds of different options that you can choose from, lots of different images um, and it can come in quite handy. So I hope that helps and I'll see you next video. Cheers guys.